Um, boys and girls, this week we are learning about the life cycle of a plant. So I want to go over our anchor chart um, to help you learn about the life cycle of a plant. We're going to start right up here where we see the picture of the seed. Um, a, a plant starts out as a seed. And let's follow the arrow. We come over here, we can see where the seed coat has broken apart. And um, there's a little something coming out of the seed. There's some growth coming on. This is called germination, when the seed coat opens up and the little plant starts to grow a little bit. So we went from seeds to germination. And now we're gonna follow the arrow down to the third part. And we can see where the roots are taking hold and we have a stem going up. So the roots and stem is the third part of the life cycle of a plant. Let's follow the arrow. And what do we see now? We see leaves. Um, the stem is getting taller and more leaves are forming. So the fourth part is leaves. And let's follow our arrow. Oh my goodness, look at those beautiful flowers. The flowers are growing after the plant gets a little more mature. And you know the job of the flowers is to produce seeds so the plant can grow again. And the next part of our life cycle takes us right back to seeds because those flowers are producing the seeds. So let's go over the life cycle one more time. We start with a seed. We then have germination, then roots and stem, leaves, and finally flowers. And then the cycle starts all the way back over again. I hope you have fun as you practice all the different parts of the life cycle of a plant this week.